Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. We are uh, on the new course, right? Angular CLI. And in the previous video, we have seen about why we need to see why we need to use the CLI and what are the advantages of this one and what is an Angular CLI we have seen. Now let's try to install the Angular CLI in our local machine and also what are the requirements needed for installing that Angular CLI in our machine. Okay, let's try to see this one. Now, in order to install Angular CLI, we need to check that whether we have proper requirements or not. Okay, so we need to check that whether in order to install that Angular CLI, we need to check we have the proper requirements available in our system or not, we need to check. So what are those requirements? Let's try to see. So we should have the node installed in your system. So the first requirement is the node should be installed in your system. So we can check the version of the node with the command node space hyphen v. So I will try to show that one how we can check that node command. So you can open your command prompt here. So you can check with the command node hyphen v. At the time of this uh, recording, so I have the version 14.17.6. If you want, this is the LTS version. Okay. And if you want to check. So node hyphen V, we can check the version of the node that is available installed in your system. If it is not, if you are able to see, not able to see this type of output is the version number if you are not able to see means. So you need to install the node in your system. So how can we install that node? So you can go to this node website. So this is the node website. And right now the 16.13.0 LTS is the latest one. So this is the LTS version that means long term support. This one we need to install, so not the current one. So this is the long term support, LTS version recommended for the most users. So this is the node we need to install. So I have installed 14.17, so I will update it. So for 16.30, if you, are, if you don't have the node installed in your system, you can install this 16.13.0 LTS version, okay? So latest it was released in something around uh, October uh, last month. Uh, so last week it has been released, I think. So we can check that one change or otherwise long term schedule or something like this we can check here and we can check that it has been released on to 10 no oh sorry so v14 v16 v current it has been released on so 2000 uh, so 10 19 so there's something like 19 around 19 it has been released i think or otherwise v16 right so v16 it was uh, released on 26 10 something around 2021 so something around uh, what i can say october last something like that it has been released so this is the latest one it has been released now this is the node is actually installed in our system so let's go move to the other thing so that is let's go here so you understood right node how to install uh, how to check the node version and now let's go to this another one so we will get the current version so the node in the system we got the current version of the the Angular CLI currently supports the Node Active LTS. So that means Angular CLI supports only the Node Active LTS. So you should make sure that you have the L Node LTS version in your system. That's it. Now you will get the current version of the Node in the system. The Angular CLI. Okay, we have seen this one, right? Now, now Node is installed in our system. Now it's time to install the Angular CLI. So we can install the Angular CL CLI globally by the command npm install hyphen g where hyphen g stands for global hyphen hyphen global we can also give hyphen hyphen global also the short form alias we can give hyphen g at the rate angular slash angular slash cli so this will install the latest angular cli in your system so this will install the angular cli globally in the machine so globally so irrespective of the project or anything application it will not be application specific it will be installed globally in your uh, in your machine that angular cli so the command is npm install hyphen g angular at the rate angular slash cli. After installation, we can verify that cli installed in your system or not using the command ng space v. Okay, this is the command ng space v. Using this command, we can check that angular cli is installed in our system or not. So where v is the alias of the version. So you need to understand that where v is the alias of the version. Now let's try to install this angular in our system so that's it right so let's try to install this angular in our system so i am opening the command prompt so we are able to see that node right and also cross check the npm also what is the current version of the npm installed in your 
system when you install the node automatically the npm also will be installed so it's not a problem so npm also i have the version 6.14.15 so that's it now let's try to install this angular globally so what is the command npm install hyphen g or otherwise you can use hyphen hyphen global sorry spelling mistake hyphen hyphen global at the rate angular slash cli okay not slash oh yeah slash so cli now let's try to install this one so we have keep we need to keep double l here okay let's click on the enter so it will take some time to install this angular cli it will connect to the cloud to the, through the package manager and it will install the angular cli and all its dependencies everything it will try to install this one so depending on your network connection and your connectivity so it will take some time to install so my system will be very slow and also my network is also very slow so it will take some time so let's we'll come back after successfully installing this angular cli so after successful installation you will be able to see that at the rate angular slash cli at the rate 13.01 so at the time of this recording so the latest version available in the angular cli is 13.0.1 so as we already know that so in the november 3rd so angular 13 the new version has been released for the further reason angular cli 13 has also has been installed now in our system angular cli 13 has been installed now what we have seen so let's clear it off all this one now what we have seen so in order to check that that angular cli is properly installed in our system or not how we can check by using the command ngv okay so let's try to press ngv so it will display you the uh, description so how uh, whether the angular cli is installed or not you will be able to see that angular cli the text in red color so by this uh, by if you are if you are seeing this one means in your system that means angular cli has been successfully installed in your system so here you will be able to see that the current version of this angular cli 13.0.1 and also the node the version of the node so what is the version of the node you will be able to see here 14.17.6 so this is the version of the node installed in my system and here you will be able to see the package manager and also here you will be able to see the os also what is the os that we are using so that is nothing but mine is the windows system so for that reason we are able to see the windows and here you will be able to see the packages also what are the packages versions it has been installed so if you are if you are able to see this one in your in your system means that means angular cli has been successfully installed so this is how to install the angular cli in your local machine so most probably all the os in all the os's it will be same like this only so now it is not exclusively for windows only so in mac or linux also the process will be same the commands also will be same only so the node installation will be different for different os's uh, but away, uh, but everything will be same only in linux you will be using sudo apt hyphen get install node you will be using in mac you can get an uh, uh, direct direct package you will be able to get so you can install that package from the node website so like that and if you want to know anything about the commands available commands also you can type ng and you can press enter so here you will be able to see all the available commands that are what are all the commands available in the angular cli you will be able to see so available commands you are able to see right so here you will be able to see ng version so in the bracket you are able to see v v means the shortcut so if you want to check the version you can check using ng version also so instead of typing this all the version we can use the v shortcut or otherwise you can use the version like this also you can get the version so you will get the version so here you will be able to see the short form notation also so if you want means so i will decrease the size so it is looking so you'll be able to see ng version also we are able to see the version so for the short way uh, alias thing v we can type it and here you will be able to see ng add analytics build deploy config uh, e to e so generate help lint these are all the commands available in the angular cli so let's try to see this one by one command so we'll try to analyze that one so this is how we will be installing the angular cli in the system hope you understood the installation so you can try in your system so nothing hard will be there or nothing confusion will be there it's a straight pretty straightforward the installation of this angular cli hope you understood about this installation process if you have any doubts or any sessions Please post the comments below the uh, below the video. I will try to give the reply as usual. And if you like this video, please do support me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you.